The parable of the prodigal son ends in a very touching way. Jesus says, And the son said to him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and in your sight, and I am no longer worthy to be called your son. But the father said to his servants, Bring out the best robe and put it on him, and put a ring on his hand and sandals on his feet. There are few of us who haven't experienced some really miserable failure. I mean, we really let someone down. And we've done it even as Christians. And so the inevitable happens. We no longer feel worthy. Now, this happens in church fellowships all the time. People end up drifting away, feeling much like the prodigal son, and they may feel embarrassed or simply unworthy to come back, and and so they just stay away. It's really tragic because the truth is we never are worthy. In fact, if we think we are, we're just deluding ourselves. What allowed the prodigal son to wear that best robe in the family ring was really not his own righteousness or his own worthiness. It never was. It was his father's. And it's the same for all of us without exception. The reason we can be in a relationship with God is never our own worthiness. It's the worthiness of Christ. We only have one job to stay under his worthiness. So if you've really messed up, if you are feeling unworthy, don't give up because it was never about your worthiness to begin with. You and I have one job. Our mission is to stay filled and to stay under the righteousness of Christ. If we do that, we can be encouraged. This has been 90 Seconds in God's Word. Be blessed.